He was right there. Hey, dude under the mattress, give up now. Here he comes. Come out to the door, do not reach for anything. At uh, the very beginning, it was a 911 call. A guy reported seeing a guy setting brush fires or small brush fires down the side of a busy road that we have. So he followed him from where he lit the fires all the way down where he ran into a trailer. Uh, the initial deputies that arrived at the scene got a fairly good perimeter set up on the trailer. Turned out his wife opened the door, came outside on the porch, and wasn't real pleased about us being there. You're not coming to my house. What was your okay. name, ma'am? None of your business. Okay. okay. Well, you're not allowed to go back inside now. Um, dude, you guys are here's, not here's, my here's door. the deal. If you're lying, which we think you're lying, you're just as guilty as the person who committed the crime. So we're gonna uh, lock your house up and secure it for a search warrant. No, you're not. Okay. Yes, yes we that's, are. That's, that's not. We're not asking. Dude, do you want me to go in there and look and see if there's somebody else in there? Hey, listen, unless you Watch want your son to see you go in handcuffs. Hey, what Please. the? The deputy started the application of a search warrant, and then. During that time, we looked in the side window of the trailer. And you could see a twin bed, and the mattress was probably at a 45 degree angle with a guy under it, and you could watch it moving as he was breathing. I gave him instructions to come out of the trailer with, you know, without grabbing anything and keep his hands where he could see him. That we couldn't destroy evidence nor access a weapon. It's a naked dude. Show me your hands. Both hands. Good. Come out to the door. Do not reach for anything. Here you go. Hands up. Get your other hand up. Walk out. Down the stairs. Once you get to the bottom of the stairs, turn around Okay, I got your lethal. Face the house. Face the house. Don't move, you understand me? Put your hands together like you're praying. Back behind you. Back your hands together. There was no reason for him to be naked at that point. A naked, sweaty man is not what you anticipate seeing come out from under a mattress. I believe he said because it was hot out and because he was scared, so he took off all of his clothes and hid under a mattress because he knew the police were at his door. Why didn't you come to the door when we were knocking on the door? I don't know, I'm scared of If you weren't doing anything wrong, what would you be scared of? Do you have warrants or something? I might have warrants, yeah. Like a misdemeanor? Yeah, it's a misdemeanor. I miss, I, I missed court like two weeks ago at work. Okay, we'll talk in a little bit. We'll get you some clothes for in a minute too, okay? Rather than saying he was just trying to start a fire, he said he was trying to light a bowl of weed, and somehow it spilled when the guy that had called us about him tried to run him over with his pickup truck. I want to know why I'm questioning on why some dude chased me when I'm trying to hide and smoke weed on my own private and he's coming in and making it a public thing and exposing me for this and that. I wonder why that dude's not in trouble. It's probably because you started a fire and then fled from there, right? Well, I probably wouldn't have started a fire if I and fled if the dude didn't try to run me over the truck three times in a row. The initial theory is that there was a, a total of five fires set by this guy. What we can tie him to is just one at this point, though. I went for assault second degree and arson second degree, which are both felonies in the state. From the trailer, he was transported to the jail, and I believe he's still incarcerated at this point. What, what, are, what are you taking your shirt off for? I'm just gonna wipe his, and he's, like, his nose is running. But why are you taking off your shirt? Because I don't have any tissues, so I was gonna wipe it on my shirt. I'm sorry. Okay, no, sorry. well, I appreciate it. Not I have that. them in my okay. car. Can I go and get no. them? No. no, just right now. He's not gonna get hurt. But it's hurting me. 